2.55 a.m. Uh, October 13, 2023. I just woke up about 20 minutes ago. Um, been sleeping most of the night. have not been on any of the CAM model sites yet. Uh, this is 2.55 a.m. Central Standard Time, USA time in Iowa, as always. I've always lived in Iowa. haven't lived anywhere else. Way down in Heinemann. This will be only posted on YouTube.com forward slash at I am Wade Heineman. That's at I A M W A D E H E I N E M A N. Um, I've never been a scammer, and uh, I've never had access to anybody's credit card information, and I've not gotten any money from any other sources other than SSI for PTSD since August 2022. So whatever else is being indicated, all kinds of indications after I posted. Uh, that I was looking for investors for about 12 of my inventions, which I have not uh, I've not communicated with anybody on yet. I may have gotten missed calls from people, but I have not returned any calls yet on it. Um, I don't answer my phone in the last three plus years. So if anybody's depicting I had a phone conversation with them, that what they're probably doing is listening to my voicemail which is two to three minutes long, and then claiming that I had an, a, an interaction with them uh, over the phone, which I haven't. I never answer my phone for the last three plus years, other if, unless it's my parents, Jerry and Lois Heineman, who are 82 and 81 years old, live at the Red and White Barn Home, just west of me here. Um, I've been home since getting groceries on the 6th, and uh, as every time I gain three to five pounds, indications I'm getting pregnant again. I can't get pregnant. I'm a male. I'm a man. Always and forever, born 11471, father of child 1995, circumcised 1971, no alterations to anything since 1971 when I got circumcised. None. Zero, just a eight to nine inches erect, three to six inches when I'm not. Natural male testicles still producing natural male, uh, you know, liquids. Um, just a man, okay? And I've only ever been with adult natural females. I've only ever been attracted to adult natural females. I've n never had sex with anyone other than an adult natural female 14 relationships 1991 to 2015 all sexually active the entire time uh the only reason i haven't had a relationship since march 2015 is my life's been destroyed by a stage lies lies theft of the by the frauds of my life's work claiming that i'm somebody they're claiming that they're me. Um, I've been here one half mile north of Fairbank, Iowa, on the west side of the road, V68, since 2014. And other than spending some time at my parents' house, 2014 to 2017, which I spent a lot of time there at the Red and White Barn Home in 2014, 2017, I spent every night home alone by myself. Uh, I think since 2017, I spent two nights in my parents' garage and one night in their shed working on my, one of my vehicles uh, in like a few years ago. Um, and this last was Christmas, I was in their garage two nights. Other than that, I have been home by myself every single night. And I've slept by myself every single night for the last five, six plus years. Six, well, actually, I haven't slept with anybody for well over seven years. So uh, not, had, not had a bed partner in well over seven years. Whatever else the stage lies, I would never, ever be with a male transgender child. I will, why do I have to continue stating these things? I've stated this how many times now? Why are people still believing the stage lies by criminal maggots? Uh, I've not had any connection to any 20-something or teen since 2016, and he wasn't my ex fiance's son was not even a teen at that time. Now he's now he's an adult. That's how how been how long since I've had any kind of interaction with any teenager or twenty something. All of that other crap is made up by little liar frauds that are trying to steal my work or for whatever reason they're benefiting from trying to claim a connection to me. 
you know, I don't know if it's because that they're, you know, they needed something in their life where they had, had wanted to claim a connection or they're stealing from me, stealing my ideas or what. Absolutely no connection whatsoever to anyone in their 20s or teens since 2016. And again, my ex fiance's son was um, not even a teen then. I, he called me dad for about seven years and I helped raise him for about 10 years. So, um, you know, if he's claiming anything negative towards me, I'd be very disappointed. As I said before, I didn't do anything wrong. And I put a lot of effort into raising him. Uh, I was his dad. He didn't, his father was not participatory in his life at that time, 10 years of it. So, and she gave him ever, uh, every opportunity to be. So I was, you know, not, I didn't uh, respect him very much because I didn't get that opportunity with my son and I don't know where my son's at for 10 years indicated, you know, it's been indicated. My son has been stealing my ideas. I don't even know where my son is for 10 years. Uh, and I know there's a fraud pretending to be my son. If he's over six foot tall, that's not my son. Um, my son is under six foot tall. So, um, and my son is white. I don't have, I never been associated with any black person named Evan or Jake. Those are, uh, those are sons of my ex fiance. 